Yehovah may have told them to do something for you and they hold it. Amen. To hold capture. You know, like there could be a man, like you, you, you may be a woman and you may like this guy and this guy could do something for you, but he ain't going to do it without controlling you or vice versa. That woman's not going to do it without controlling you or job, business, whatever it is. And so they move out of witchcraft, that spirit of control and manipulation. And you have to pay attention to this. The, the, we are living in a day where people just don't believe and trust God. You know, you don't believe in prayer and the prayer of faith and you'll be healed. Nah, you got to take 15 to 20 pills a day. You have to, you know, you have to do this and that. Well, no, God, uh, uh, what they say, God gives common sense. Common sense. That's what they say to you. And see, and you know, to be honest with you, it's, it's a very touchy area because guess what? Lean not to thy own understanding in all thy ways acknowledge him and he shall direct thy path. Let me tell you something. If that's not the truth, then why, why are you serving him? And isn't it funny you, that we're living in a day where people take scriptures out of the Bible as it's convenient for the wrecked life that they're trying to live. I'll say people take scriptures out of the Bible and misinterpret them for the wrecked life that they choose to live. Either you believe it or you don't believe it. Either you believe all of it or you believe none of it. If you believe half of it, you're lukewarm. He's going to spew you out anyway. So why not just go away from it and do whatever you're going to do? Hey, listen, anybody knows that there's pleasure in sin. Sin is joy for a season. Anybody says that they didn't have pleasure sinning, I don't know, I don't, I don't, I don't know them kind of people. But the reality of it, the word says there's pleasure in sin for a season. For a season. Amen. So you want to realize that we can trust Yehovah. Yehovah is pouring down and meeting all your needs from the heavens. The skies are about to open for us. Amen. Not me, us. Amen. The skies are about to open for the people of Jehovah. And he's about to pour out some things. But listen, this is the space where you just got to believe him for it. And leave these people that are in front of you that are trying to manipulate and control you. Leave them alone. Let them go. Let them go. Trust Jehovah. Trust him with what? With everything. Amen. Everything. Everything. Oh, I'm almost finished. In Isaiah 45, 1 through 3, this is what the Lord says to his anointed, to Cyrus, whose right hand I take hold of, to subdue nations before him and to strip kings of their armor, to open doors before him so that the gates will not be shut. I will go before you and will level the mountains. I will break down gates of bronze and cut through bars of iron. I will give you hidden treasures, riches stored in secret places, so that you may know that I am the Lord, the God of Israel, who summons you by name. Jehovah is calling you by name. Everyone under the sound of my voice, this is your call. There is an open door for you right now. There's a purging and a cry and a worship that must come together. Sound the alarm. Gather the people together. For Jehovah is calling you by name. And he is going to destroy the enemy. Jehovah has went before you. And the victory is yours. You better believe what I'm saying to you. Let me tell you something. No weapon formed against you shall prosper. There is a call. There is a cry going out. Your advice went before you to prove himself. Purge yourself this day. Purge. Begin to do the purging process. The cleansing. The washing. Ah, that we would walk through this open door. Hallelujah. Won't you get it in your spirit? Get it in your spirit. That's the season, the time that we're in. Jehovah's calling you. He's calling you. 
He's calling you. He's calling you, woman. He's calling you, man. He's calling you, grandfather. He's calling you, grandmother. He's calling you, father. He's calling you, mother. He's calling you, uncle. He's calling you, aunt. He's calling you, son. He's calling you, daughter. Little children, he's calling you. There is a call. And he's calling you by your name. Won't you heed to the call? Won't you submit to the call? Of the purging, the crying, the washing, the worshiping. You've been invited to go through. And Yehovah has went before you. And everything's prepared. He's knocking down the walls. He's tearing up the gates. And no man can shut this. For the power of Almighty Yehovah has went before you this day. Get it in your spirits. In Matthew 6. Matthew 7 Matthew 7 Matthew 7 and verse 7 Matthew 7 and verse 7 and 8 Ask and it will be given to you Seek and you will find Knock and the door will be opened For everyone who asks receives The one who seeks finds And to the one who knocks, the door will be open. Listen, my beloved brothers and sisters, let me tell you something. Jehovah is doing something great. Listen, we want to walk through this. I've seen it. I've seen it in a vision. Amen. And Jehovah is pointed by this. The glory of the Lord is released even now. And I heard the Lord say, to tell my people, the purging process starts now. I have moved you into a space in front of thee an open door that is endless realms of my glory blow the trumpet and horns and the sound the alarms as you're entering a space set aside for restoration of my church as you enter in you will be welcomed by the by my angels and the sound of worship from the heavens and all that you need is beyond this door. Cry, cry, cry aloud and worship me. For I will restore my people to wholeness. And you, the man and woman, young man and young woman and children, shall all be changed. I said so. And so shall it be done for thee in this space. Saith the Spirit of the Lord. And Father, we thank you for your word under the Neosaya. O Yamanda de Dios si Ramanda lo se yaba kalalo lo se yaba shata o Yaman yaba sa yaba lo se yaba de Dios o yaba sa kalalo lo se ya yaba sa ya na 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 lo se ya king yaba sa thank you na 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 lo se o Yamanda de Dios ya glory 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 o Yamanda de Dios ya Oh, glory, 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 glory. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you, Yabase. Thank you, Ayamanda Rossi. Hey, Yabasa, We give you glory, we give you glory. Quicken us in your word. Quicken thou me in your word. Quicken thou me in your word. Quicken thou me to your call. We want to be quickened to your call. We want to adhere to your call. We want to move with your call. In the mighty name of Yeshua, the Messiah, the Holy One. Oh, not a one be lost. I open my hands and I carry. Yabasaya. Hallelujah. Yabasay. Oh, Nanadiosaya, in the mighty name of Yeshua, everyone under the sound of my voice, heed to the call. It's your season, it's your space. Receive of Him and be blessed in the mighty name of Yeshua, the Messiah, the Holy One. You that are sick and afflicted, the Lord healeth thee. You that are backslidden, the Lord restoreth thee. You that are incarcerated, the Lord frees thee. You that are in all kinds of sin, perversion, lust, wandering the mind and eyes, 
adultery, fornication. The Lord delivereth thee right now in the mighty name of Yeshua, the Messiah, the Holy One. <coughs> you that are in rough places, financial situations, you don't know where to go from here. Yehovah gives instructions. Yehovah moves you through the open door. Won't you worship him? If you would get into worship, worshiping him moves you through this open door. Yehovah has a place prepared for you. It is for you. It is your season. Yehovah has not forgotten about you. Lift those hands and praise him. Lift those hands and begin to worship him. Listen, let me tell you something. Clap those hands. Make a sound. Make a noise. Oh, will you cry, 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 cry aloud? The sound is going off. And the Lord calleth thee by name. Yield to the call. And that heed to it. And see thy name be blessed. And thy seed seed be blessed. And thy nation shall be blessed. I shall not almost say, say of the Lord, thou shalt be blessed. Heed to the call he's calling you he's calling you man he's calling you woman heed to it in the mighty name of Yeshua the Messiah the Holy One our men and our men Yehovah bless you today you all under the sound of my voice listen there's a call and he's calling you by name amen you can't get mixed up it's personal he's directing this directly to you I'm speaking to you he's speaking to you today and listen, there's a purging. Yield to it. Yield to it. All your needs will be met on the other side. For Jehovah is wet before you. Our men and our men. You that are out there in these special prayer requests, listen. All you got to do is email me at I won't miss live at gmail.com. That's I won't miss live at gmail.com. Jehovah is concerned about you. I'm concerned about you. Let's, let's touch and agree. Whatever the need is, and Jehovah is going to meet that need in the mighty name of Yeshua, the Messiah, the Holy One. Amen. You that, um, that may have a friend that you want to send this message to, listen, all you got to do is click on share. You can click on share and you just email it to them. Doesn't cost anything. You can download it and, and play it continually until it enters in your, your spirit. Amen. Put it in your library. Amen. Get yourself one of those discs, one of those flash drives, and just start saving this stuff. It'll work for you. And guess what? Listen, there's many series, and it don't cost you nothing. I'm going to keep talking about that because guess what? That's what time it is. Amen. The only way that we overcome the enemy is by attacking him with words, truth. And listen, and guess what? The truth may be challenged, but you can't beat it. Amen. You can't win out truth with a lie. You can't win out truth with deceit and craftiness. No, you can't. No, the only thing that you can do, because guess what? All lies will find themselves in the pit of hell. And that's where you're going to go with your lying self. And I just said it over the airways. Listen, and it's going to come. Amen. And I'm just excited about what Jehovah is doing. Listen, and all you that want to help us. Amen. I'm trying to build this army. I'm going to keep saying it. Listen, we're going to grow. I'm believing by faith. And I want you to click follow. Amen. After you listen to this broadcast, and won't you follow me? Amen. Won't you participate and follow me? And that's where I'm at right now. Follow me as I follow Jehovah. Amen. And that's all we want. Listen, until the next time, I want to say Shalom Shabbat. Jehovah's blessings be great with you. Amen. Special love out to my pastor and friend of music. Amen. Pastor Jason, listen, man, I love you. Continue, keep doing what you're doing. Voices of Variety, shout out to you. I love all you guys. You're special to me. You don't know. You're just so special to me. And Yehovah has increased. I send it. Yehovah sends increase all over you. He covers, he covers your whole dimension, your whole realm. In the mighty name of Yeshua, the Messiah, the Holy One. He even gives a greater anointing and increase over your life. I speak it right now. In the mighty name of Yeshua, the Messiah, the Holy One. You're blessed coming and going on every side. The hedge of heaven falls even now. And it covers you. Receive it. In the mighty name of Yeshua, the Messiah, the Holy One. It is so done and sealed. Okay, until the next time, be blessed. Our men and our men. I'm praying for you. I'm praying for you, whatever the Lord, He calls you to 
Come through.